Welcome, it's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. Welcome back to Shadows. <laughs> oh yeah, we're going outside. Yeah, go find that my little bitch. Fucking weapons back, you son of a. Hey, we're outside. Fish. Oh, is that? Bitch. Is that? That was weird looking. Oh, it's Death Stranded. Are those yeah, all fish? fish. <laughs> oh no. Into the depths. The depths is where we fight the gaping dragon in Dark Souls. So uh, let's hope not for that. Uh, let's let's not talk about Dark Souls. This is Resident <laughs> Evil. I'm tired. We're playing video game. I'm talking about video games. Shut up, Watson. <laughs> shut up, Watson. Are we going back to? Sh shut up, Watson. <laughs> yeah, you guys took the long way. The fucking house is right back over here. Oh, now we're gonna drown. Good. Good. <laughs> Good. Can't think of a single bad thing about what you just said. Oh, wow. Although it was nice to see the nope. other characters. Like, hmm, that was cool. Not dead <laughs> well just like that they were not nice. they not weren't that makes me like dead. jack a little more they weren't inherently evil <laughs> but i'm know, still very actually... upset that lucas played such lucas! a small role uh, are you sure i missed it back back because now it's well maybe no mind. oh damn oh damn put that in your inventory you have more space now yeah you, you, uh, i was watching I no i yeah you did you missed it in a enhanced handgun map a hand, little, 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 little. read yeah. February 18, 1892, there was a collapse in the Patterson Mine. Tuan and Beckford are dead, and Huxley will never walk on his own again. Old man Stan was right. The ground there is too unstable. February 19, 1892, the company's not going to send us any replacements. They want us to work double shifts instead. I can't wait to get back to the old country. So, foreigners and uh, 1892. I don't know if that's entirely relevant. That's a helicopter with the Umbrella Corp logo. Is that yeah? It could be. Potentially. Are they watching us for that helicopter? Oh, this was in uh, that was in the demo. Huh. But they said the demo wasn't gonna be in the game. I, they were no, fucking no. lying. Not only was the demo the game, it was the best part of the game. <laughs> yeah, it really was. No. Well, Nick can be the one to scoot over if that's the case. Yeah, that's what I like. <laughs> Had reports is in the abandoned mine south of the property. I'm gonna go have a look. Roger that. We'll meet you at those coordinates. If you encounter Evelyn, orders are shoot to kill. Repeat, shoot to kill. Okay. Oh, look, you can use the antique coins. It's the same stuff as earlier. No gun. You've taken me as things. Cool. So that's always helpful. Yeah. Is even. Is Ethan? You should just take nothing and then uh, see how far we get. That's dumb. <laughs> um, Is that the good shotgun? Yeah, we only have the one shotgun now. Yep. <coughs> I suppose I should probably take this just because I have so much goddamn ammo for it. Yeah, 261 machine gun ammo. There, yeah. Probably take this handgun, it seems to be more powerful. Of course. And the first aid med there. Yeah. And the uh, the toy axe. Which Still. never came into use, we must have missed or something. Or the toy shotgun, yeah. Mortar, anything else? You got yeah, five antique coins, see if any yep. of those are good to use. Probably the steroid. Um. Yes, run to that, see what happens. Uh, that is the. Yeah, if you click on the top, X, I'll yep. tell you what it is. Oh, what's the other ones? Uh, the other one is the stabilizer for reload speed. And then the other one just has zero in it? So what does that stand? The other one was the 44 Magnum. It just moved the things here. Alright, oh, that's kind of dumb. Yeah. They should have given us the revolver Magnum. Like they Wait, do so what's in, in the right one? In the far right one? Uh, stabilizer for reload speed. It helps you feel it? Reload speed? Yep. Speed road lead? Yep. Do you have enough for it? Nope. Um, let's see here. Stabilizer. Reloading speed. Yep. Indefinitely. 
But it's, I, I would I would have done that if it was like fucking slide a hand. Yeah. It's not. Uh, it's, it's very slight. It's like a hand. <sighs> um, I do have to admit, I love the safer music in this game. It's, um, it's not, not Resident as, Evil Four, yeah. but it's. I'd say it's a little better than Resident Evil Four, but uh, I was guessing it was Resident Evil Two. I disagree with that statement. Resident Evil like I, the, I'm the opposite right there. Resident Evil 2's Save Room is, I think, the best song in any Resident Evil game ever. Okay. I'm gonna go out on a woman and say Nick doesn't agree with me. Well, he also doesn't I'm, like I'm in the middle of, or, or one or in the three. middle of shooting. Why am I doing this? Here. I feel like those would be more uh, useful on like, oh. the boss battle or something like that. Nah. Are you dead? Yeah, he's dead. I can't tell if he's dead or not. <laughs> Stop moving. Hmm. I don't know what the fuck was that. Oh. Oh, look, it's the big elevator. Have, you take have to the I forgot to. I forgot to get my shotgun shells. You Shit. gotta take that big elevator to the Sadler fight. Now we gotta take the elevator up to the Sadler fight. It's the same. It looks the same. It looks very similar. Yes. Oh, look, there's a box. Where'd that guy go? There's a few boxes. Yeah. I don't have nearly. burner fuel. Yeah, I don't need that. Um, uh, uh, do these guys spawn infinitely? Mm, I don't know. Cause they weren't here a second ago. Ron already doesn't have an arm. Well, yeah, they just sometimes spawn without arms, though. Yeah. <laughs> There's your uh, Chinese takeout. The fuck is that? Strong chem flu. I'm convinced it's fucking Chinese takeout. It looks like a big bag of jello. Of jello? Yeah, look at it. Have you ever seen a bag of jello? Nope. Nope, that's why it looks like a big that's bag a, of jello. Dude, that's a blood transfusion. It is um, a big blood transfusion over there. Don't be stupid to me right now. <laughs> uh, okay. Looks so, like you just punch something in the face. No, never mind, it's draining. What'd you just discard? Uh, burner fuel. Burner fuel. Hang on, hang on. There we go. I think that's all you need. Hey, a thing. On. Oh. Oh, I need a. Well, you can make a strong one. Yes, I can. I got two of those. Yes, I do. What are they? You got the strong med fluid. Uh, is it just? Is it just like a? Uh... It's a green red herb. Yeah, that's a. Is even. All right, going up. Actually, maybe it's, oh, oh, we're going, we're going down. down into the mines that they talked about. In the mines, the unsafe mines. That's, That's like, spooky. Just very black. Me. Uh, oh, now it's blue. Okay, now it's just wall. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, so let me the fuck out. Okay, there we go. You have to pick your feet up to move. Just FYI. So now we're looking for liquor. The liquor guy. I hate these fucking retards. Well, they just hit way too hard. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, well. Lucas is better out here. Lucas! Maybe. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. You wouldn't have him down here otherwise, though. Oh, there's God the damn it. I don't want to go all the way back up there to go get it. Maybe we should just take them both. Well, if we die, well, we can reload. <laughs> and come back with the shotgun. God damn it. Wow, this doesn't take, take down all these fucks. It's uh, safe for remote bomber. There we go. You, you die now. Thank you. It's I a real big shame the machine gun kind of blows. Yeah. Big dicks. Do I have my... Damn, well... I was debating on doing that anyways. But I wanted to know but for you sure. You used a strong one. I only have Ooh. strong ones. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it takes too much steps. So you gotta... That does look safe.
This would be a nice time to have my shotgun. There's no way they're not going to throw something at me in these tight corridors. I wish they would just throw the final boss at you already. Yeah. Which is sad to say about this game. I just want it to end. Oh. Hey, cool. The gift of God. Detonating bombs. God's last gift. Okay. Cool. Oh, they're by you. Oh, yeah, you fuck them. You have a fast game? Hey, when does that uh, the final boss they were alluding to show up? Never. It's kind of what it's starting to feel like. What the fuck is this? Some bullshit. Apparently. Uh, what the fuck is this? I can't m move on that side of the cart. I have to. You got this. What I've got oh, this is, is a major pain in my fucking ass. Anyone still alive? No. I don't look like it. Why? Why? Yeah, I don't. No, 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 just can't. Dumb. Oh, okay, there we go. You gotta push it. Oh, duh. Hey, good luck with that. Okay, nice. Joe Jones, Jones, Joe Jones. Good job, Indiana Jones. Can we play an Indiana Jones game? Uh, there aren't... Well, uh, there are some, but we don't want to play those. I liked one of them. It had a giant octopus monster that used to scare That's me as a kid. That's not Indiana Jones. Yeah, it was. <laughs> That's the weirdest part. Giant I think he was fighting the Kraken. Uh, what is this? What is... Is that, is that another bomb? Yeah. Oh, yeah I don't close. know why you were... Oh, hey, yeah. well, I can step. Easy. I can step on my own. Yeah, I, I was can't. like, it's easy to understand how you would do that when uh, the time bombs have little to no effect on you. That one just. Uh, yeah, that's Lucas. Where's Lucas? Lucas. Is Lucas back? Please, please say Lucas is back, cause. Oh wait. Look at the monitor behind you. Yeah. Yeah. Friday, January 16, 2015. Thanks to you guys, it's been about a week since my head's been clear and back to normal, and she still thinks she's got me. You guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does she look like a little kid, but she's about as stupid as one, too. Wait, this is where they made Evelyn? Okay, what was that noise? No, we'll keep reading. Sorry. The doors are closed. They can't come in. <laughs> Mom and Dad are still totally under, though. I was wondering if this whole family obsession something you guys programmed into her. It's kind of fucked up. That bitch Mia is still somewhere in between Evie La La Land and reality. She gets pretty violent, so I locked her up in a cell. I thought maybe Evelyn would get mad since Mia is her favorite and all, but she doesn't seem to care. She actually goes and visits her sometimes. She thinks Mia is her mommy. Like I said, her bioweapon is fucked up. Evelyn's family obsession is getting out of hand. She's making everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the street to add to her freak show of a family. Maybe she's getting tired of Mia not coming around, but it's still a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever someone come new comes along. By the way, Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin is getting all wrinkly and she's getting gray hair. So that's supposed to happen. It's almost like she's getting old all of a sudden. That's the girl in the wheelchair. Yes. I did I say who this was. Totally saw that coming. Huh. Okay. Did I have any chems at all? No, just a bunch of her herbs, herbs, birds. Just a bunch of blurbs. You still have the antique corn on you too. I do. Never put those for. Don't need them. Whatever. Did I take them? Yeah. Nothing around, I guess, though. So what's in the cryo chamber? A box. What's in the box? Target acquired. What's the target? Oh, this was whatever was in that other box. It was the fetus. Oh, here was what it said. E necrotoxin destroys cells of any subject based on the E series bioweapon model used only for disposal of E series assets. The toxin must first be stimulated before use. Do this by placing a sample of the E series cells into a necrotoxin chamber. The cell, uh, yeah. So that's where you put the vial of her tissues. Oh, very cool. What's in this one, though? <laughs> really wants me to have whatever's in that. It's another antidote. antidote. Antidote for Evelyn. So that's why in the beginning, when you pick up that picture of the old lady, it says E001 on there, because she's the first E-series. Huh. What's it say? 
This project was instigated in 2000 as one of several concepts of the company's next best next generation experimental battlefield superiority initiative, working with the technical assistance from HCF to develop a bioweapon for neutralizing combatants en masse with a minimal direct contact. Next boss was later folded and all its assets diverted to this project. What makes this project markedly different from conventional weapons is its ability to turn enemy combatants into allies, converting hostile elements into willing servants. Since this effectively eliminates the cost of not only POW weapons, POW handling, but also combat itself, it's no wonder we had the and even the organization chomping at the bit to get on board. The project would never have existed were it not for the discovery of the remarkably progressed vicariant evolution fungus that we commonly term the mutamixite. Yeah. The fabrication uh, method for each bioweapon was yeah. a, to introduce uh -huh. the mutamicite genome to a pre-stage 4 human embryo and perform cultivation in a oh, controlled yeah. environment over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. The resultant organization, organisms were referred to as candidate specimens and graded based on the usability and the impractical and faulty Series A through D to perfect its E series. A common appearance was selected for the bioweapons that are of a roughly 10 year old girl to ensure ease of blending in with urban refugee populations. The first easier specimen, named Evelyn, was proven capable of secreting the mutamicide from her tissue at will. It is also of note that Evelyn's mutamicide, I don't fucking know what that word is, imposes a profound control over body and mind when introduced into a host organism. We still have a lot to learn about the mechanism by which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the working theory is that the vector is similar to the auto-inducer pheromones used for quorum se sensing in pseudomonas bacteria. Evelyn's control is exerted in a series of discrete stages, the first of which is hallucination. Almost immediately after infection, the subject begins to see images of Evelyn, though she is not in fact there, and even hear her voice, which is inaudible to everyone else. Auditions with infected subjects throughout the stages of infection reveal that at first the phantom Evelyn appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring the companionship or assistance. As time progresses, she begins making more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation and attacks to on, on other people. The psychological shock this induces helps to break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect, and by the time mental control is achieved, the mutamicite infection has progressed through the body cells, so the body... So, you were right, too. What? In, like, the second or third episode, you were, like, brainwashing when you saw the way Mia was acting. Well, It was yeah. brainwash. Well, yeah. Well, I know, it could have just been, like, infection, but instead it's... Well, even, and brainwash, even in specifically. An, even in infection. Jesus Christ, more reading. Evelyn's functions also this include the ability to form organ... Yeah, actually. <laughs> so we're going to read to the end of the episode, and then you guys can get Story more. Story time. Evelyn's functions are also include the ability to form organisms from mucilia, the fungal filaments. The term organization, organism is used loosely here. Strictly speaking, they are superorganisms formed of countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that they exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest prov prov provocation. Eh. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength gives them significant battlefield potential. The researchers have been called these superorganisms the molded, made of mold and also molded as in shape. The name has a certain elegance to it. No, it doesn't. They're shit. For the treatment of accidental infections performed on samples of Evelyn's body tissue produces a unique fungicidal serum. Administering the serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify, but if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is therefore a disposal of infected subjects rather than a cure. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjugating it to mm, would enhance its effects to extreme poten potency. Po potency. potency. God, becoming compo compound, we now call e-necrotoxin, which in even tiny amounts. What's been interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple, oca multiple occasions that infective subjects were compelled to act as a mother or father, treating her as if she were really their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as the theme of her mental control? This is just speculation, but it could be she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to blending into social groups than a lone girl. On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort might suggest that she's making up for a perceived lack of love in her quarantine upbringing, a parent's love. Well, there we go. We read a lot. Next time on Shoutsiders, we will read less, hopefully, and get those items. Bye. E.